What's up, baby? Welcome back to another episode of Evie's Cliche. My name is JJ, and today we're gonna be doing another episode of From Coast to Coast. Uh, this should be episode number seven, I believe, after Anima's last defeat or our defeat. Yeah, our defeat against Anima. Yeah, phew, that was amazing. That was an amazing battle. I will add on to that. But today we're gonna be battling a follower slash subscriber uh follower on twitter subscriber on youtube yeah uh his name is evan um this guy is guy we've been setting this battle so it's gonna be a pretty good battle so oh you mix battle and briefly what i am bringing um well i'm actually bringing dom fan from last time which would be an impish dom fan uh my stealth walker fully defensive uh, invested blah, blah 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 but it does have the citrus um uh, Zippo, which is my Charizard, uh, only nickname Pokemon that I actually have because I actually bred that one and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, that's gonna be my Mega Evolution Weakness Policy Dragonite, the normal gem Abby Palm, which you know you guys are familiar with Abby Palm if you've been watching this series of Do or Die Battle Spot Singles. Yeah, so and I'm bringing the Life Orb Yan Mega. Oh, that thing is powerful, especially with the Beast Speed Boost and Choice Scarf. Choice Scarf. Hydreigon. This thing's gonna be powerful, just powerful. But uh, yeah, so my opponent brings the thunderous. Ooh, that is scary. That is actually scary. Um, I don't know how I feel about that. I'm, I mean, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not thinking too good about that. Thunderous, thunderous, ooh, thunderous. Anyways, Arcanine is also a thing right there. Arcanine. Oh, Subat, Subat. Ooh, this is an interesting battle. Subat. Uh, my opponent also brings Mega Blastoise. That thing is tanky as uh, a tank. This is a tank. That's all I'm saying. So, um, Fortress, another tank. Oof. Did I bring a spinner? I think I only have one spinner, unfortunately. Should have, should have brought my, I should have brought my gold bat. That would have been so essential. But of course I didn't. So my opponent, my last opponent's Pokemon is Chrono. Focus Sash Chrono. Why not, right? Why not? So. At this point in time, I predict my opponent to bring in either the Fortress or the Crodont. So I'm automatically gonna just start. I automatically just start with Zippo. Oh, actually, I'm gonna start with Ambipom. Ambipom is a thing. Ambi. Oh, 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 oh. We went to summary on uh, unfortunately. Summary. So we're gonna start off with the uh, Yen Mega. Oh, why am I saying Yan yeah, Mega like like you, dude? Come on, it's like nobody's business. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna start off with Ambi Palm just to get the fake out in. Maybe potentially a U turn. Uh, or we can go thieving. We can be thieving up in here, stealing people's cookies like oh, we always do. You know what I mean? By the way, a uh, beautiful lady in the background. That's my sister. Yep, she's she's there, just chilling, 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 showing that, showing that, uh, showing that model look right there. She's a feature model. Mm -hmm didn't know but <laughs> we'll save that for the future because you know um spoilers are not great spoilers are not great um, they actually ruin they ruin what's about to happen but my opponent actually starts with water cannon i like this i like this i like these nicknames man i am messing up i'm i'm out of it um i'm out of it so uh yep like i said i'm gonna go fake out hopefully my i predict my opponent to switch out Maybe, but this thing is tanky. Why, why wouldn't he just like take the damage? You know what I mean? He does switch out as predicted, but into what? Uh, something with the Rocky Helmet? Legend! And, ooh, Legend. I like this. Rocky Helmet? Potentially? Oh, just to get the Intimidate. I like that. I like that. I like that. So, let's see what you have. If you have something good, I'm taking it away from you. Let's see what you have. Rocky Helmet? Yep, and there goes the Rocky Helmet. Uh, this must be a bulky variant, which is pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Uh, I could, I'm gonna go ahead and U-turn out, uh, in case he wants to go ahead and go for the, you know what, I can just take his item off, and that'd be a great time, right? <laughs> that'd be a real great time. Uh, I do wonder who has the leftovers, though. Hmm, hmm, ha, huh, hmm. Scratching the beard. The beard. I don't know if you guys are fond of beards, but man, this, this might be, it might be, uh, I enjoy my beard. I uh, shouldn't be talking about myself right now, but it, it's the beard, man. It's the beard. Wow, this lighting is getting a little bit too bright. But U turn or thief? That is the real question of life right now. That is what I'm facing against right now. But 
don't want to get too crazy. So let's do this. Let's go around. Come on, girl. Oh, I'm jamming out. I'm jamming out. I'm I'm going off with the music. So Charmander over here. Let's go with the U-turn. U-turn. I really want to switch out into into to what? What do I want to switch into? What do I want to switch into? What do I see you going into? Like what? What attack? Like I'm just gonna thief you away in the U-turn. I think that's the best bet. I'm just gonna thief. Even though I'm intimidated, I think that's the main thing. Like I'm intimidated. It sucks. Uh, yeah, it just sucks. Goes for the morning sun. Cool, cool beans. I mean, I'm I'm not tripping. I'm really I'm not tripping. So at this point in time, I'm just gonna U-turn out. You turn out, and it's gonna be a good time. He's probably gonna switch out too. I mean, why wouldn't he? But wow, legend is so fat, so fat. <laughs> I, I need to carry a fat legend too. I really do. So uh, he gets hit with the rocky helmet. I go ahead and you turn out because <laughs> I ain't got no business in here. Nah, not today. Look, look at the pitiful damage. I should, I should have been doing so much more, man. I don't even know what's going on. Not today. Not today. Um. At this point in time, I can go for a Dom fan, do all kinds of crazy stuff, right? All kinds. So, that's what's gonna happen. Hopefully, he um, switches out. I'm gonna start setting up on my opponent. Well, actually, setting up hazards because I didn't want him to predict my hazardous uh, self coming in. But stealth rocks, it's gonna be a thing. I'm coming in. Uh, you know what? I need to start taking pictures of my opponent. I I'm just messing up. All kinds of messing up, but it's okay. It's okay, it's okay. Charmander's on my side because obviously Zippo's in. Zippo, Zippo, I love that name. I love that name. I don't know if you guys are, are fond or familiar or admire. Maybe you admire. And this actually forces out my opponent, which is pretty good. Admire Richie from the series. So here comes the spinning pine cone, which is okay. I'm, I'm, I'm not mad. Why? Because obviously um, that's kind of the thing. You know what? We're going to start playing smart. I can easily just set up all over my opponent. That's one thing there. I could bring in the Yam Mega. Or I can just bring the Zippo and call it a day. Call it a day. I don't want to bring Dragonite because obviously, obviously it can get hit. Uh, but Zippo on the other hand. Zippo in the other hand can take some heavy, heavy hits. So I'm going to go. I'm definitely going to go for um, Zippo. Zippo is going to come in. I predict a stealth rock, so I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not fishing for any more damage. Like screw that. So uh, bringing in Zippo. Here comes with the toxic. Ooh, that was a great play. Imagine if I would bring Dragonite. That would have been, that would have been the end of me. Honestly, that would have been really unfortunate. But right here, I should be forcing my opponent out again, unless it actually wants to stay in for a fire blast, which I doubt it. So. Um, maybe he wants to set up the stealth rocks and just get rid of it. And uh, I mean, obviously, still has the sturdy, so it could either stealth rock, rapid spin, or maybe just rapid spin and call it a day. But I'm, st I still have Thom fan around, so I don't know if my opponent's about that light. So hopefully it is. Hopefully he stays in. And I can just get rid of this pinecone because pinecone, pinecone, isn't your name Fortress Pinecone? He must have nicknamed him pinecone. Pinecone, yes, there it is. It's not. I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. I'm just here, here waiting for my opponent to see what's gonna go down. By the way, I don't know how many of you guys are actually gonna get Smash, um, Super Smash, or Super Smash Wii U. I think Smash Bros. Wii U. I don't know, but I am. My opponent withdraws and brings in Legend again to absorb this Fire Blast. Uh, it is intimidated. These rocks are gonna hurt him, uh, which is okay. I still figured he was gonna bring either this. Or he was gonna bring in that um, that Blastoise to take the hit, but either way, Blastoise should be dead to a Solar Beam after because it is slow as I don't know my grandma on a wheelchair. <laughs> I don't know, man. That is messed up. But anyways, my my grandma would totally kill me. If, you know, but Legend goes down. I guess it's not specially defensive, so that's a good thing. That's a good thing. I mean, not bad, not bad. It's 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 all good. Um, so yeah. Here, my Mega Charizard Y, majestically, just, is, is that a violet, is that a, like a violet, uh, violet color, like purple? It's not black anymore, I mean, when any Mega Evolves, it's just not black, it's 
looks like purple and red it's just beautiful beautiful stained blood red so thunderous is definitely gonna take us down um i should i should have brought a gra oh i can bring dom fan back in and that's gonna be a thing I can bring dom fan in go for um go for an ice beam and or ice shard and i think that's that's about it i mean that's i think the best move right there and yeah unless i want to bring dragon knight and then like you know just like take on this thunderous but i can actually do that i'm gonna he's probably gonna go for the hp ice why would he bring the hp ice, the HP ice is dangerous that is dangerous that like kills half of my team so i'm not about that life i'm not about that life wow i brought a horrible team <laughs> i didn't even think he's I just put them together i was like okay well i like you i like you i want to put you in here and i just brought i was like this is power this brings hazards this cleans up hazards my opponent goes for this full switch which um predicted an electrical move so my opponent has no other choice but to either switch out or take this ice shard or go for the hpic withdraws which is okay which is okay i'm not mad i should have gone for the earthquake but it would have been nice to switch out at the same time that would have been great so at this point in time i want to switch back out i really do just for the soul soul for the soul like a, a soul like i'm looking into your soul for the soul pack that soul pack wow that's not even coming out right uh that he already toxic me once and i predict him to try to toxic me again so in case he does bring the stealth rocks i got zippo out already ready to take some uh some more uh toxic damage you go to the stealth rocks which is pretty good i'm glad I'm glad because now I can uh, force this thing out and whatever comes in is going to take some serious damage. The the Sturdy is not in. Uh, we can predict him to switch out, definitely predict him to switch out, which I am actually going to do. He can... Uh, I want to predict him to bring in Blastoise, but either way it's dead after a, after a Solar Beam. So I'm going to let him switch out. This is the plan. I'm going to let him switch out. Bring in either Blastoise... Uh, and take him off in the next turn or if he brings in thunderous i'm gonna let thunderous take this fire blast switch out and rapid spin away that that is the plan right there force him to switch out again and, and hopefully he brings blastoise or somebody that can take out my thumb fan that is a plan that is a thought process behind that again like that you know it's just just getting some uh some of my thoughts to you guys see so you can kind of predict what's gonna happen maybe if it does happen if not then hey that was a good prediction um but yeah my my hair is just everywhere i don't know the any who or any uh i don't, don't want to say the other word but yeah so my opponent withdraws hopefully he brings a thunderous if not blasters come in water cannon comes in actually and yeah that's predicted so it's okay it's okay because hopefully my turns are not being counted if the sun goes out on this turn it's gonna be very unfortunate and the sunlight does fade okay well i forgot about that i didn't put that in the account so my opponent has a chance to live i can go for a fire blast but it's not gonna kill it's not gonna kill so whatever comes in here is gonna take a harsh amount of damage you can go for anything just like hurt me bad 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 it's gonna be bad 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 so he does not have an ice beam we know that for sure he does dark pulse aurora sphere maybe water pulse and what's the other one aurora sphere dark pulse dragon pulse so i think those are the big ones right there so here's the thing here's the thing i'm gonna have to go with dom fan i'm gonna have to go with dom fan that's just automatic there's no way uh, I have to go with Dom fan. I didn't predict this. I didn't predict my son to be gone. I really didn't. So, this is what I can do. So what I can do. I'm thinking about it. I can bring back Ambipom. Bring back Ambipom. Let it die off. Bring in Dom fan. Spin his rocks away. Switch out into Zippo. Zippo Fire Blast. How about that? Does that sound good to you guys? I hope it sounds good because it sounds good to me. <laughs> Yeah, it really does. It kind of just you know just here. So I mean, I'm sorry, Ami Palm. You are beautiful. You really are. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. You are beautiful. But I need to get rid of these rocks. These rocks are gonna kill me. They're gonna kill me. Like, do you know how much damage that does to Yanega? Ugh, there's so much damage, and I cannot, I cannot 
afford for Blasters to be faster than me. I just can't. I can't. So, here goes Mega Blastoise. Coming in. Getting in this party. VIP pass, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen. That is a VIP pass to the water pools. Best. I'm dead. I'm dead. I, I should have I should have just like written down the death sentence on top of my pokeball but nope ain't got that kind of ain't got that kind of uh, what's it called I don't know what you call that but I ain't got that kind of stuff going on or that and I don't even know what I'm saying I'm just gonna quit I'm just gonna quit I'm just gonna quit mm. but anyways so uh sat oh, damn it I forgot about the rocks again I'm not doing my plays right I'm not thinking this through he withdraws which is pretty cool now if he has a ghost type he doesn't have a ghost type, so Pinecone comes in. Um, that's pretty cool. Pretty cool. I get rid of the rocks. Just fine with me. I get rid of the rocks. So, at this point in time, I get a crit. I get a crit. I get a crit. This thing, this Pinecone, it's gonna be gone. It's gonna be gone in any time in the moment, baby. Let's see, let's see, let's see. We're gonna bring back Zippo. I mean, that's all we have. Unless we bring Dragonite. We can bring in Dragonite and do like... Some freaking dragon dances and just get rid of stuff. I think that's a, I think that's the thing there. I mean, why not, right? Uh, I am choice scarf. Should be able to outspeed a good amount of things. I should. Unless he comes in with, uh, unless he comes in with um, thunderous and wants to like T wave me. So that's gonna be a thing as well. I don't know if he wants to switch out at this point, but I would, I would, I would, why not, right? Why not? Hmm. Question is, should I? Should I? Should I? What would Jesus do? Come on, come on. In the comment section below, please, if, 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 if you see me, you know, provide, provide me with that information. What would Jesus do in this situation? Would he bring in Zippo? Or would he bring in Dragonite? I don't know. I hope I don't offend anybody with this. It's just, I'm just... I'm just trying to like help myself come through this because uh, the zip was very very predictable I don't want him to get a play off of that he's gonna bring in say what's it called thunderous hit me hard but if I bring Yamega I can outspeed hurt him really bad afterwards with uh, anything I have but I'm gonna bring Dragonite just because hopefully he switches out as well gonna bring Dragonite maybe he might might think like the way I bring it in I have fire punch but I don't I know I don't ladies and gentlemen I don't he goes with the rock slide good job good job on that that was pretty that's super effective that's pretty pretty good so okay uh as as I saw what the damage she did I can easily just rest up <laughs> I didn't predict that but my weakness policy actually comes off that is great weakness policy okay so 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 here's what we can do he can switch out that's one thing i can roost up i can roost up I can roost up or i can d dance d dance and then extreme speed after that so i'm gonna d dance and then extreme speed just in case just in case because i know he's gonna switch out unless he sets up rocks here then it's over it might be over for him I'm pretty sure he wants to conserve this pinecone because this thing is setting up on me. It's gonna do all kinds of crazy stuff. So, uh, yeah, I think that's uh, I think that's what's gonna happen here in this uh, short little time split here. But, huh? I did get a message on Twitter. See what happens there. Uh, yeah, there it goes and anima. Hmm. But yeah, so sorry, I'm just I was reading some. But yeah, um. But yeah, so anyways, anyways, any anyway, sorry, I'm just I kind of went off and thought right there. I was reading uh reading some uh, comments here on the on the L U Tubo, L U Tubo, but uh yeah 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 yeah. So yeah. Hmm, hmm. So I have a comment question. I don't know. I want to start doing those little comment questions that not everybody does, but there's some people that do because I have some interesting things to say. But pinecone withdrawals, withdrawals. But here comes a thunderous, as predicted, which is pretty good. It takes a lot of damage uh, from the stealth rocks. Dragon dance right here, getting up that attack and that speed. So 
that's gonna be really really good for us and now I'm pretty sure an extreme speed should take out my opponent no doubt about that so here comes a plus three plus one plus three attack plus one speed uh, extreme speed should take out my opponent no doubt about it so uh, he let me he actually let me set up which is uh, really unfortunate for him but uh, you know I'm sorry man I'm sorry I think I think I think that uh, that's about to do it here so bad I'm actually interested with this look at that beautiful so bad it's gold oh my god look at that oh dude that is gorgeous I want one of those I want one of those and I'm gonna get one of those by the end of today I honestly am that is amazing like I want one of those <laughs> <laughs> I'm all over that camera. I'm sorry, I'll just look away because it's like, I don't know. Just... <laughs> anyway, so, enough of that stuff. Enough of that stuff. Time, time to act real. Stop acting silly. Uh, the question is, an extreme speed would it be able to take out, um, would be able to attack a Swoobat? How bad are you, Swoobat? You're Eviolite. I know you are. But you're not going to take out my Dragonite. I wonder what you have. Let's go for an extreme speed again just in case well I should have gone for a Ooh, he goes for the psychic too much damage this does Ooh, okay okay no I'm going for Roost uh, I'm planning to take you out with Dragonite so I hope you predict the Roost because it's happening it is definitely happening so here goes the Roost bam look at that look at that Baby, you mad, huh? I'm mad. I, I would be a little upset, but sadly, it's gonna take a lot of damage, potentially lowering my defense. Yep, there it goes. Special D job. I'm not. I'm not waiting no more. So, um, mm, 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 another one would take me out. That is the bad part about this. So, gonna extreme speed again. Gonna extreme speed again because, uh, yeah, yeah. I, I was gonna think this was gonna be a Dragonite sweep, but it's not. It's not. Not today. Not today. It's not gonna be a sweep. So what is my opponent thinking? What are you thinking? What are you thinking, Evan? What are you thinking, bro? Huh? Tell me what are you thinking? I am watching you. Believe it or not, I'm actually watching. Watching you so bad. Look at that beauty. Look at that beauty. Oh, look, look at that. Like the, the on its forehead, it's like a. Well, it's just two years, obviously connected, right? It's just so. Hmm. I want one. I really do. That tail though, that tail. And it has a heart on the nose, man. That is beautiful. But here comes the extreme speed. Uh, I'm not risking anything. I'm not risking any switch-ins or anything like that. But yeah. Yeah. Here goes uh let's see what, what else is my opponent gonna bring in this this 66 from coast to coast battle. Comes with a pine cone. I did predict that. I obviously did predict that. So I am a plus three. Gonna go for the dragon claw. Hopefully this actually takes out my opponent because I don't see a rock slide actually taking me out and it's a potential miss. That is a thing right there, a potential miss. So come on. Mm, you're so fat. You are just fat. And I avoid the attack. Mm, the hacks, the hacks. I know you're mad. I'm kind of upset because that would have been the game changer. That would have been the game changer. So I'm going to go for another Dragon Claw. Because, well, actually, that's not going to take out my opponent, sadly. He actually has an opportunity to go for another Toxic and actually change the game here. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. Go ahead and do that. Go ahead and do what you got to do, bro. Do what you got to do. Just Toxic away. But this Dragon Death definitely going to not going to take you out because it's not very effective, right? So, Rapid Spin. Get rid of the rocks. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. So, um, what should I do? What should I do here? Should I recover? I can recover. I can recover up. I don't see. I don't see any more threats. I don't see any more threats. I can. You can go for a toxic just for the fun and giggles, but, 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 just in case. Just in case. Should I go for roof? Nah. I still have like an assert. Uh, assert all of Arsenal. I have an arsenal still. So, don't want to be that guy. Don't want to be that guy, honestly. I'm glad I took the Rocky Helmet away from this thing. No, no, it was the other Pokemon that had the Rocky Helmet, which was, what, Arcanine, I believe? Yeah, I think it was Arcanine. So, 
Uh, if he toxics to me here, that's gonna be very unfortunate. But either way, what's I mean, I would, I would. Uh, what else do you have? Rapid spin. I mean, that's the only thing you would do. So I'm gonna go for a Dragon Claw here because I don't want to risk the. Root. I mean, I don't want to risk the toxic. And if he does bring in whatever brings in, I could either roost or just extreme speed it. Just in case, just in case, because right now Dragonite is kicking that ass. Oh yeah, smacking it left and right. That's fine, that's fine, we're having fun, right? Wow, this is going to be a very long episode. I don't mind, it's okay, it's just thinking a lot, thinking, processing, doing all kinds of stuff. Um, my I, I, I courtship, it's not uh, all the way up there in advance to, you know, but still... It's getting there. It's gonna get an upgrade like Porygon 2, become maybe one day a Porygon Z. I'll be there. But my opponent brings Water Cannon. Uh, should I be worried? I don't know. My special D did actually drop, so maybe I should. But I'm gonna go for the Stab Dragon Claw. This should do a, a good amount of damage. It's Stab. I think it should take out my opponent's as plus three. So there goes Water Cannon gone. Out of the map. <sighs> this is a dragon, dragonite sweep. I guess. I guess this is a dragonite sweep, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, Larry. Huh, Larry the Crawdot. I like that, Larry the Crawdot. Okay. You do have the dragonite. I mean, I have the dragonite. I can, I can go for the ruse, and I can go for the double ruse. Go for the double ruse. I don't want to be that guy. Why would I want to be that guy? Let me just get some damage off on you. How about that? How about that? Because Aqua Jet is a thing. And if he takes me out with that Aqua Jet, which I hope not. Which it shouldn't because I resist. I just want to make sure I did a good amount of damage. And bring him down to... No Sash. It must have been Life Orb. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting enough. And I think that was the game. Um, wow. That was quite, quite fast, I believe. That was kind of fast. Um... Wow, uh, Emmons, thank you very much for that battle, honestly. <laughs> wow, I'm sorry, I guess setting, uh, I guess Dragonite is just too good. Dragonite is just too good. Um, Evans, thank you, thank you, my friend, for that battle. Uh, that was great. Thanks for accepting my, my battle, and, uh, hopefully, uh, you get to see my side of the battle. Uh, yeah, but for everybody else, thanks for watching. If you haven't already, please subscribe, it would help so much. Um, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. That would really show some love to this channel and well, my videos actually. See if you like what I'm doing. If not, um, you know, um, positive criticism is always welcome. How about that? How about that? Yeah. So, um, go ahead and um, yeah, just do me that favor if you please will. If you don't, if you don't mind. Um, but yeah. So other than that, if uh, if anything else, just. I forgot I was actually going to do a common question of the day. So let me think. Let me think. Common question of the day. Comment question of the day. Huh. You know, I'm not ready for that yet. I'm not ready for that. Let, let's get more more people in here. And then maybe I'll start doing some fun stuff. Because I have so many great thoughts in my head. I am like a, a semi-wannabe philosopher. I don't know. I don't know. It's just thoughts in my head. You know, you ever sit down. You're working. You're doing something on your own. And you sit down, you start thinking about life. Well, that's me. That is me. I start thinking about deep stuff about life. Like, like, I heard this one joke that was funny. Um, a trash bag. You're, I don't know if you guys heard it, but if you have hashtag trash bag, if you already have that, that's this one right here. So it was like, uh, what was it? Real quick before I end this video, is is actually really interesting. So trash bag. They say. Is a trash bag really called? Why is a trash bag called a trash bag if the trash is not inside the bag? Until you actually place the trash inside the bag, that's when it's actually called a trash bag. I know that sounds kind of confusing, but it actually has a point. Isn't it just called a bag? Yeah. So in the in, in the comment section below, hashtag trash bag. If you already heard about that one, but that is some deep thought. That is some. That's something you think about when you're high or something. I don't know. I don't know. But I saw it on a meme or something. It was it was kind of funny. Uh, it, it amused me. It amused me. I just kind of ha ha ha. You know what that? Yeah. Just, I just did that. So other than that, I'm gonna end this. Uh, I'm gonna end this video already because I'm just gonna be babbling about. So or. Ranting? No, that's not a rant. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. What are you saying? What are you saying? Uh, but yeah, anyway, so 
thank you a lot for watching. This means a lot to me. It really does. Um, I do this for you guys and uh, just <laughs> just show some love. I'm good. I'm good. If you don't, I'm still gonna be doing this. I love doing this. This is this is me. This is a hobby. It's awesome. It's amazing. I love this. I love this. Okay, so I love you guys. I love you guys. You are the best. So uh, yeah. Other than that, like like I always say, don't forget. Don't just don't forget. Just sit back, relax, and game on.